Today, you'll learn how to manually extract a game or movie disc that has been inserted into the PS3 but cannot be extracted normally by pressing the eject button. There are two different methods for extracting a disc, and you'll need to check the model number of your PS3 system to determine which method you should use. Locate the sticker on the back of the PS3 system and note the numbers and letters at the end, following CECH. This is your system's model number. The first disc extraction procedure we'll show you applies to the model number shown on your screen. If you don't see your model number listed here, then your PS3 system is an early model that unfortunately has no method for manual disc extraction other than sending your system to an authorized service center. Now let's extract a disc from one of these PS3 models. To begin, turn off the main power switch on the back of the unit. Then, place your finger on the eject button. Keeping your finger in place, flip the power switch on the back of the unit into the on position. When you hear the fan start to kick in, repeatedly press the eject button until your disc comes out. For the other applicable models, we'll use procedure two. Take a second to verify that your model is indeed compatible with this procedure. You will need a Phillips screwdriver. To begin, flip the unit over and completely remove the black rectangular tab. Don't be afraid to use a little force if you're having trouble removing the tab. Insert your screwdriver into the hole, punch through the tape, and then turn the screwdriver in a counterclockwise direction. Keep turning the screwdriver until you see half of the disc emerge from your system, at which point you can safely remove the disc by hand. And that's how you can manually extract a disc from most PS3 system models. If these methods didn't work, then you may need to send your PS3 in to be serviced in order to recover the disc that's inside.